Hi everybody, welcome to my July in review. Today is July 31st, as you can see. And um, I wanted to do my July review the very last day of July and get everything in. I probably won't post this for a while, but I wanted to get it in on the last day of July. So my first, um, the first canvas that I started, I started this July 1st and I ended it July 12th, uh, was Prunel, and I have him framed. He looks absolutely awesome. I'm hanging him in my stairwell. So yeah, he turned out really good. I did a post review, I did everything on him, so there's other videos if you wanna see more on Prunel. Um, God, he just looks stunning. I'm gonna put him over here real quick. So I ended him on July 12th. Um, my second start was my Paint Gem Butterflies. Um, I finished these on the 20th. I tried to do one a day. Here's a Monarch, Crimson Patch, Colorado Hair Streak, Zebra Swallowtail, Clouded Sulfur. I go over these in another video too. So all these beautiful butterflies. I had so much fun doing these. The enhancements were so much fun. I used crystals. I used, I just went to one, a page on this one. Um, I used crystals. I used ABs. I have to replenish them now. <laughs> I ordered more, so I, I've already gotten them, but look at how beautiful. I totally recommend this paint gem kit, by the way. Tiger Mimic Queen. Papil Ulysses. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? So I finished these on July 20th. This, my husband mounted this on a piece of wood. Don't look at the back, it's ugly. This is my welcome sign that I finished. I started this July 1st and I finished it on the 15th. Um, normally I don't start projects um, in conjunction with, with, with each other, but I always start a paint gem on the 1st and I always start a large canvas on the first, and I just had this in the background. So we just took some wire. This is super simple. It's just literally, he just found this in the garage. You can see all the glue all over it, but this is what you see. So I love how this welcome sign turned out. I think it turned out really well, and I, I really like it. I'm enjoying it. So that was my third one. My fourth start was on July 3rd, and it was my 4th of July paint gems. If you guys remember, I had forgotten that I had this kit. And on the 3rd, I panicked. <laughs> and I started doing these paint gems. I was in a frantic pace trying to do these. Um, I did not finish these until the 20th. So there's that. I just did not have enough time. So. I had fun doing these. Again, these are highly enhanced. I didn't do the beer and the, I didn't do the food. I thought that would be weird, but yeah, you can see all the enhancements that I did on here. Look at that eagle. Isn't that beautiful? I have a video on this too, so yeah. So I finished these on July 20th. The fifth one that I did was this small heart. This I call it a rainbow heart, it's from Timu. I started it July 16th and I finished it on the 17th. And I just think this is adorable. Oh my gosh, it was a 20 by 20. Just so cute. Isn't that cute? I love it. So I finished this the 17th. My sixth start was this tree with books. I started this on July 17th and I ended it July 22nd. I really like the way that it turned out. Um, it looks better on camera than it does in person, but I think it turned out really nice. I like the washi tape that I used. Um, Everything was, I, I just, I didn't have any problems whatsoever with this. It had a lot of confetti, but that was okay. Um, I got through it just fine and, and I enjoyed myself. Um, 
my seventh my seventh start I started July 19th was these dragon coasters for my daughter and I finished these July 24th I wanted to get these for her for her new apartment aren't these pretty really like them I had fun doing these all these different dragons she really likes dragons. She actually has some bearded dragons. So I did those for a gift. My eighth start was my August Timu calendar, which I started July 23rd and I ended it July 23rd. I don't show it on here because it is not licensed. So, um, okay, my ninth start was July 24th and it was this milkweed painting that I ha got as a gift from Mushy over at Dark and Creepy Diamond Painting. Please go over and start following her. Um, I started this July 24th and I ended it July 26th. I think it's beautiful. All the colors, they just turned out so nice. I just really like the way that this looks really really pretty nice and sparkly okay sorry i'm looking at my notebook here i've got my notebook here's my notebook <laughs> um my 10th start was in a world where you can be anything be kind um i started this july 27th and i ended it july 28th um yeah oh yeah with the tree and the milkweed i wasn't feeling good i was sick okay i was wondering why those took me two days um this took me a day to do so i don't know how many hours because i don't keep track of hours but the look at the lettering on this this is what really gets me now um on my video where i do the kidding up of this i actually link the six pack of this came in a six pack so i link that in the description if you're interested in getting these they all had sayings on them i did reverse image searches on them so they're good to go it's got butterflies. do you see the butterflies and everything in there it's just the colors are just i mean look at how it's just like bam in your face so yeah this was i started it the 27th of july and i ended it the 28th of july my 11th finish was this flowers in a vase i call it flowers in a vase um blue flowers in a vase i guess but there's a white one too and it's got butterflies i started this july 29th and i finished it july 30th and again this is another one that turned out really nice this is an amazon find um i absolutely love it i couldn't find this one again um i you know, you type in flowers and vases and all kinds of stuff come up. So um, I couldn't find this. And you, you might be like, well, just go back in your search history uh, from when you purchased it from Amazon. But my son has Amazon Prime, so I send him everything. And I'm like, can you order this for me? <laughs> so he uses his Amazon Prime. So I got that. So um, yeah, so this is my 11th finish. And my final finish is this pantry sign. I started that uh, July 30th and I just finished it just now before this video started. So I don't know if I like this sign or not. Um, the colors are not what I thought it was going to be. It's almost, it, it's kind of hard to see on camera, but I swear to God, it's pink. I'm not kidding. Like it's pink, like there's pink in it. Um, but my husband has, I have this frame and he's like, I think I can cut that frame down to make it fit in here. So he's going to try to cut this frame down and I'm going to maybe hang it over my pantry. I haven't decided yet because I'm not like in love with this at all. Like I, I don't know. I really don't know about this. Was this this was unnecessary confetti? It was just so unnecessary, but it is what it is. 
so that's what I finished. I did the pantry. I did the blue flowers in a vase. I love this one. Oh my gosh, I love this one. I was sick when I was doing this one. I was kind of grumpy. <laughs> I was grumpy when I was doing these two. I was posting them on Facebook. I'm like, man, I'm never gonna get these done. Um, my heart, my little heart. I just love that. It's so cute. My welcome sign. I like my welcome sign. I just, I that just turned out really nice. My two paint gem kits, my dragon coasters, and then Purnell, which I'm not gonna bring up here. He's He's sitting quietly by himself right now. So that is it for me for July. For August, I have a very, very special project that I'm gonna be doing. You guys will have already seen it because I'm sure I'm not gonna post this August 1st because I have too many other things to post. So um, anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Um, make sure to give it a like and subscribe if you're not subscribed. And I will see you in a future video, my friends. Loves.